a big cat rescue. Oh, I can see a, is it a jaguar, the ones that are black? These are nice enclosures. Yep, that was the Forever Florida boundary. There's a spelling error on that sign and it bothers me. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah. So that was like a big cat rescue thing that I just went by. And now I have a three mile road walk. It's super hot out. You know, so How's it going, boys? Okay. Cows always make me so nervous. Oh my God, I'm so excited. There's another one. Pinto. Is this you? Eugene, I think I met you the other day. Oh, I love it. It's another bench in the shade. I'm gonna take a picture of it and send it to my new friend I just made. Friend I just made, Boston. He's going to be so excited. We just got done talking about the benches on the road walk yesterday. <laughs> Thank you, Eugene. Here we go. Here we go. Ugh. Going into the Three Lakes Water Management District. Do, do, do. Yeah, cloud cover. Also, look at that. It's a bunch of resurrection fern, but it's dry, so it's all furled up like it's dead. And then as soon as it rains, it'd be like, ta-da, all green. Yep. Whoa, those bromeliads are huge. Holy mackerel. I'm a plant person now. Well, I met another Sobo. He seemed very nice. I hung out with him for a few minutes while I had lunch and got water. And now I am somewhat conflicted because it was nice to get to talk to someone. <laughs> Although I'll see my mom tomorrow. But you know, another hiker. Anyway. He's camping like five miles short of where I wanted to camp. Maybe I'll stop and I'll just eat dinner there. I'll text him and see how far back he is. Maybe I can eat dinner and we can chat and then I'll go where I was supposed to go. Or I could go to bed early and then just do the extra miles tomorrow morning and get up early. I don't know. The spot where I was gonna camp, <laughs> two of the girls said that it was super creepy. It's like an abandoned RV lot. But, and I know, I, I know this area, so 
it is kind of creepy. But also, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to think about this and see where my new friend is. There's a really weird smell out here. It kind of smells like fire. That can't be from... Oh, maybe it is from a fire in the cabbage palms. Ow. Or, no, what are those called? I know that those are old ones because of how long their things are. That makes more sense. So the smell was so strong over on the other side, but I couldn't really see. They were just kind of singed a little. Doesn't it look so alien? It reminds me of those Ocotillo kind of. Day 25, I think. Yeah. I did 35 miles today. But it's only like 7.30. And this is the earliest I've gotten to camp yet. I could have gotten 40. But if I went to the 40 mile place, it's this abandoned RV park. And it just sounds really creepy. And honestly, I'm tired of sleeping in places where I feel uncomfortable. I've done it so many times now. So, uh, yeah, I just set up camp here at Godwin, 35 miles. And I'm going to get up real early and head out. Because um, I'm going to go to River Ranch, get my resupply. I'm going to eat something there. And then I'm going to head to Kissimmee Prairie Preserve. And I'm going to try to, I'm going to figure out if I'm going to camp there. Or if I'm going to go a little bit farther to that cowboy crossing. But either way, I'm taking a shower, you know? <laughs> yeah, it's going to be great. Anyway, it was a really beautiful day today. Except for how hot it got. It got so hot. I just had to stop in all the little shaded places and chill for a second. Um, it was really fun getting to hang out with another hiker, though. And we exchanged, like, Instagram information. So we were, like, messaging. I like sent him a picture of this bench I got to first and then he sent me a picture of him at the bench. <laughs> which is funny. I thought he was going to camp here too, but he ended up staying at the fire tower, which also sounds cool. Um, yeah. Anyway, hopefully I get a peaceful night's rest and <gasps> yes, fireflies again. Oh, I love it. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. Good night's rest. And then River Ranch food tomorrow. Resupply. My bag's going to be heavy. Yay. I'm almost done with this thing. It's crazy. I can't believe I haven't taken a zero in 25 days. Like, that blows my mind. You have no idea. Like, I, I love a zero. Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do like a sleep meditation thing and I'm just gonna go to sleep, hopefully. <laughs>